how to export a custom FBX to Unity. In this, we'll go over how to export a custom FBX to replace and patch the existing FBX of this avatar. So the first thing to do is go into your hierarchy and then look at, click on the armature. In the inspector, we want to look at what the scale is. In this case, the scale is at 100. Some other avatars will have this as 1. This will determine how you're supposed to export on in Blender. So going into Blender with your custom FBX, in this case I want to export face tracking shapes. So in this model, I'm going to go to File, Export, FBX. One of the neat things you can do with Blender is have presets. I have Unity, then I have Unity in 100, Unity with 100 leaf, and Unity with leaf. And these are different uh, configurations that uh, vary between avatars. In this case, this is Unity 100. So I just basically, most of it's going to be default and say the same. Now if it's Unity by itself where the scale is 1, it goes to FBX full scale units. And that's the only thing that changes. And then Leaf just has this checkbox for add leaf bones at the end. So we want to export as Unity 100. I'm going to go to the folder I want this to be exported and overwrite, Kiribati example and just drill into the folders until you get to the FBX folder where it's contained. So we're going to click on it. We're going to turn red that we're going to be overriding it. Now one of the things you can do if you don't want to, if you want to revert this is you can go in Unity and go into that folder where the model is, open it in Explorer, you can copy and paste and just you can put dot bak so it just changes the file extension and confirm and now uh, that is change the file extension now by default the file extension does not show on uh, in Windows so you can you have to enable that. So we'll go back to Blender and refresh it. Oh obviously it won't show it because it's not a FBX, so we're gonna export as FBX as a hundred. Once it's done it'll be show save. Then go back to Unity. Then it should load back in. Now sometimes the the mesh will change, so ever all the orientation stuff will it'll disappear. But in this case, it does not. So if you go back to the body, the blend shapes, all the blend shapes that we added are there. 